Hey guys, and welcome back to Art for the Week. So for this week's project, we get to become graphic designers. What is a graphic designer? A graphic designer is an artist that basically works with businesses to help create um, branding, logos, designs they might need. So that's what we're gonna do. This is a three-part lesson. This is the first of the three parts where we're just brainstorming our brand idea um, and we're creating a, a drink idea basically. So a soda or something like a Gatorade or a health drink, um, bubble water, something like that. Anything that's school appropriate, you're going to develop the idea for the brand. Okay guys, when you're creating a brand, the question who is the most important thing? Who are you selling to? Um, that determines a lot about what everything looks like, what it tastes like, what the name might be, what the logo might look like, what the font might look like. Who is everything when you're creating a brand? Okay, now that you know who you're selling to, the next question is what? What are you selling? Um, are you selling juice or soda, a health drink? And it all depends on who you're selling to. If you're selling to an athlete, you probably wanna create something more like Gatorade that might help them hydrate or something that might give them energy. The next thing we need to start thinking about is the name of the brand. How do we create a name? Well, it should be something that maybe appeals to the person you're selling to, the who question. Um, maybe the name could be something that just even sounds fun, or maybe it can be descriptive and kind of describe what the drink is or who it's for. The next thing we need to think about is our logo. What does our logo look like? Can you tell me what these brands are without anything other than the image? Probably Nike, Target, McDonald's, Shell, Starbucks, Apple. They're pretty easy identifiable logos even though they say nothing at all. With that one image, we're able to not just know what the brand is, but know what the brand stands for. Have you guys ever tried to play around with different fonts when you're writing a paper? Well, fonts actually are very important when you're creating your logo or branding because there are many different types of fonts that you can use that speak a lot to um, the word or the brand that you might be creating and might help your design in your logo a little bit. So you can go to Google Fonts or you can go to defont.com and find a bunch of different fonts to kind of play around with and see if you can use one of those to help inspire you uh, when you're creating your design. The last thing I want you guys to create is a slogan. Um, and a slogan is something that says something about your brand. So we've got some examples here. I'm loving it. Um, just do it and taste the rainbow. We all know what these slogans are and what brands they connect to. You need to create a slogan for your brand um, itself. All right, so here's my example that I created. Um, this is basically what you guys need to have by the end of today. Um, you've got to answer the questions. Who is it for? What is it? The name of it, the logo, the font, and then the slogan. So for me, you guys know I love surfing, so mine is for surfers. Uh, what is it? It's a coconut water mi uh, mixture with vitamins. Um, kind of to give uh, surfers like a little bit of energy to help them get through a long surf session. Um, the name, I kicked around a few different names, but I came up with Pipa Vida. So uh, Pipa is kind of like what they call coconut water when you go to Costa Rica and surf there. They call it Pipa like when you drink it out of the coconut. And Vida just means life. So I thought that'd be a cool name. Um, I played around with some different logos and fonts. Basically, it's just a sketch that you're really showing me. You can see how my sketch is even messed up a little bit. You can see my pencil lines. I went over it with marker, um, and I tried to create a font that I thought was interesting and different and kind of said what I was trying to get across. The slogan for this one, um, just try to keep it pretty simple. Surf more, hydrate less, because you want to spend more time in the water surfing and less time recovering and drinking uh, water to try to make sure you can surf longer. So this is the concept. You guys are creating your very own. Um, don't use anything that already exists. Don't use my idea. Create your very own idea with your very own answers to all these questions. Can't wait to see what you guys are making. And then next week, we're gonna start developing the actual can of the drink that we're making.